Hello, hello everyone, and welcome back to The Witcher. I'm Peter Moxon, Keeper of the Archives, and last time we finally actually started being productive again and got through uh, Suspect Ramsmeat. No, did Ramsmeat, did we actually get through Ramsmeat? No, no, he was blocked on the last bit of um, evidence, but he also gave us some evidence to go against uh, Kalkstein. So we're progressing the secondary plot that is also somewhat the main plot, but isn't marked as such. Hi, kid, you just teleported. So let's go confront Kalkstein about that so we can get some evidence on him, and then see where that leaves us. Oh yeah, we also uh, did the crypt stuff for the con artist. Oh, and I got uh, armor and stuff upgrade because I spent a lot of time gambling and kept that off, uh, off recording. Stairs. Let's talk. Mm. Evidence indicates you're linked to the organization. What evidence? The wounded salamander mentioned you. That's likely since I hired him. What for? To help with my experiments. I had no idea he belonged to a secret organization. I suppose he distilled the fifth essence and dusted the philosopher's stone? He protected me from Salamandra and did other tasks. He risked his life for me, and your sarcasm will not change that. Get out of my sight, mutant. I believe you. It's suspicious that people you hire are chased by Salamandra. I don't know who pursued Berengar, but I had nothing to do with it. You didn't try trapping him to hand him to Azar Javid? If I worked for Salamandra, I would never let myself be linked to Berengar. You offend my intelligence. Go away. I believe you. I don't know enough to decide. Let's drop the subject for now. Right. We can't waste time. When you find that criminal, I'll gladly help. But now, back to work. Okay, so there's that. Might group. Check the journal. Okay, so Ramsmeat, reopen later. Calcine, reopen later. Old friend uh, requires story progress, I believe. Dice poker, I need to look for uh, the professionals, but I can just kind of do that later. I think I might. I think I maybe have finished it for chapter two because it kind of lasts through the entire game. Oh, epilogue. Okay. Uh, lost lamb. Oh, right, that's a thing. Right, right, right. I've done it for this chapter. It, continu it continues in chapter three. Forgot about that. Main quest. Main quest. Main quest. Wanted. Levarden, I wait his next move, so I can't do anything yet, I think. What lies beneath? That requires us access to the cemetery, which requires the gravekeeper, or the uh, grave digger, the, the, the guy making the coffins, which requires getting the thing either from Vincent or... Thaler, or Taller. My apologies, it's not Thaler. The, the TH is just a uh, aspirated T. Taller. So let's try talking to the detective now that we've run into a dead end with our two remaining suspects and see if he has anything new. Yes. Come on. Come on. I have signs. Uh, you. Come on. Why can I not use signs? Oh, there we go. What? Yeah. No? Okay. Strong. Hi there, Raymond. Thanks, Geralt. You saved my life. The bastards snuck in here. Somehow they found out I'm after them. What did that do? What happened? Salamandra. I was a step away from solving the mystery. One small step. Relax, Raymond. You're safe now. Not likely. They're following me day and night. I gotta find a way to lose them. What do we do? I'll set a false trail. You question the new suspects. Who? Here, take these notes. They list all the key leads. What do you intend to do? 
They're on my heels, so I've got to disappear. I'll draw them away while you pursue the investigation. I'll find you, White Wolf. I thought there were only six. Is there... I must cross-question the witness. The suspects start with Ramsmeat, Thaler, and Varden. Are you going to have dinner first? Oh, suspect Lavarden. Oh, hell yeah. Did the fourth guy disappear? You're act you know what? <laughs> I'm going to do this right quick. <laughs> what happens if I talk to you? Welcome. You won't believe what happened. Tell me. Not so fast. Remember, I have expenses. How much do I owe you? 200 arons. This investigation is getting expensive. I'm not the Prophet Lebiota. I can't live on roots and berries. Neither can my informers. I guarantee you these are the bare necessities. For 200 orans I could get. The costs are what they are. Take it or leave it. Really? Yes? <laughs> I don't have the money, so I literally can't pay him. See you later. Okay, uh... Journal. Still have Calcine, still have Ramsmeat, but now we have Lavardin, and that looks like the only difference. Tell Lavardin I found proof of his innocence. Yeah, because we've already worked with him, so there's no question that he's innocent. We are literally selling him Salamandra brooches because he hates the high there. Mr. Marlowe sent me. Oh. What's happening? Raymond said he has some new information. Come to his house as soon as you can. I'm at his house. The message. I think that that was for the thing we just did with him. I basically fucked up the game by doing stuff too quickly. I thought that dog was like a woman lying on the ground for a little bit, so I was just looking to see if the art was messed up, and nope, I'm just insane. The bard in. Yay! Army life's tough. Yes? I seek the Sephirot stones. I haven't yet located them all. I thought you might know such art and oddities. I once purchased one for its magical potential, which turned out false. And I paid a mage a costly sum for the examination. Then would you sell it to me? Sell my Tiparath? <laughs> I'm rather fond of it. I'll give you a good price. Five hundred orns? I didn't think it was worth so much, but all right. I wear Tiparath as an amulet. We can deal right now. I don't have the money yet, but I'll bring it soon. No hurry. I'm not that eager to make the trade. Okay, cool. So we can get Tiparath from him. Yes. I've nearly completed my investigation. All right. Speak. If you don't work with Salamandra, who are you? A modest merchant. Allow me to show gratitude with a gift. A 500 orans. This symbol signifies my secret society. We seek to destroy Salamandra. Learn anything useful? The Salamanders have risked much. This is a political matter, let me tell you. Some larger schemes at play in Redania. Few people know the secret. King Faltest, the Lodge of Sorceresses, and I watch the northern border. How does this relate to Salamandra? Azar Javed has sent a special force north. My men saw them. He too knows something's brewing and is making preparations. Okay, interesting. Completed Lavardin. 500 Orans, yay! Yes? I have 500 Orans, though it's quite a price to pay for a stone. I sadly relinquish it. But my reputation would suffer, as would my business, if I did not deal. The Sephira is yours. Damn it. I was hoping we'd get a discount off of that. Yep. We need another hundred just to be able to, to advance the main plot. Yeah. Wait, you don't want the brooches? Huh. 30. You are a jeweler, so that probably is the best price for that. Hold on. <laughs> Just because it makes it so much easier if I do sell that. Yeah. 
Let me do a quick search here. Witcher 1 Eternal Fire Signet Ring. Do I need it after Chapter 1? Cannot be bought initially once acquired, it can be sold and then repurchased. Okay, I'm going to not read these out loud just in case of spoilers. Okay, uh, the thing it says it's useful for is actually just the stuff from Chapter 1, so... That's a gold ring, red stone. Also obtained for a white goal in the outskirts. And no comments that are readily available. Okay. Since there is nothing listed for Chapter 2 or beyond in terms of, like, uses, I'm going to assume that I can sell this. If I need it later, whoops. Okay, 20 orange is not a ton. Uh, do I have those heads on me? Wolf pelt, okay. If I can find a merchant to sell wolf pelts and monster parts and such too, then I can get at least, like, 10 or 20 orange out of them pretty easily. And then between episodes, I can gamble for another two hours and get up to a thousand orange or something. It is such a slow process. Let's see, the blacksmiths probably are more interested in materials, not so much, um, uh, animal parts. But you are the main merchants I still know about, so let's give it a shot. You. What do you Where's... Mr. Okay, we can sell you Zirconian, but, uh, no. <laughs> ah, Flint, one each. Good to know. Oh, you just have an infant source of that, I guess. Hmm. Okay, uh, there's a peddler and an antiquarian over here. Does, does Vivaldi sell anything? I don't think so. Is all done. What? Never mind. Because we get so many secondary weapons, I really want to sell them, but I don't think anyone actually buys them. Ah, crap. Okay. Same as Levar same as Levarden. Plus for five, buys for one. Yeah, I doubt any of those are going to sell to someone else for more. What? Nothing. Fucking disease. Patience. Ah, crap, how do I make money? Wait, you're a merchant, aren't you? Look. I can sell you some stuff. Ah, uh, four honeycomb. I'll sell you like three of these. Four. Five gives me the 20 that I need, so go ahead. There, I can com I can continue the main quest now. I'm flat broke, but I can do it. I don't want to sell the I don't want to sell blah, blah, blah. I don't want to sell the honeycomb by the way because it might be useful for something. I don't remember what at all, but I feel like it is. Yes. Hold on. See you later. My medallion's going off. Okay, is that actually... Because I, I read a thing... Yeah, yeah, it's going. That is an awesome little detail that I'm not going to talk about. Yes? This investigation is getting expensive. I'm not the prophet. All right, 200 orans. Down to business. They transferred the prisoner after the attack. Not good. 
Especially since we won't get anything else out of him. He died last night. How did that happen? Well, he wasn't in great shape, so I guess it's no surprise, but I have a feeling. Someone helped him along? Exactly. Shani is a good friend of yours, right? Ask her to do an autopsy. Once we know the cause of death... Wait a minute. Are you spying on me? That's my job. See you later. Yeah, fair, fair it is. Anatomy of a crime, finally. Also, uh, Vizima Confidential... Phase... Oops. Phases... Ah, the meeting was actually an important one. That's what allows something I've been waiting for that I completely forget what it is at the moment. Okay, this is, uh, is this Kalkstein? Yeah, the final thing is with that. Suspect Rams me is still here. Yep, okay. Yeah, that's that. That's the Sephiroths. Yeah, yeah, it's this one. Uh, it is Gravedigger's Gratitude. Okay, uh, let's do uh, the uh, Anatomy of a Crime. Yeah, there it is. Because uh, the Gravedigger's Gratitude starts to go along to uh, kind of shortcutting some of the stuff. And I want to try to clear Kalkstein first. Are you at the hospital? Yeah, I think you should be. It's, it's daytime. Yeah, I want to try to clear Kalkstein first, then do the graveyard stuff. Just in case I accidentally skip out on some um, uh, side quest XP. Geralt, we need to talk. What is it? Some people died at the hospital. Were you involved? Explain yourself. I wanted to question a prisoner, one of your patients, but thugs interrupted us. It was their bodies the guard discovered later. Hmm. I'll tell you what I overheard. The prisoner will be transported to a safe location. Thanks, Shani, for understanding. Just watching out for you. I need you to help me with an autopsy. What? What? That's illegal. It's necessary. Visit me at night. We'll talk. See ya. Okay, let's go talk to the Gravedigger just to see if we can get those quests, uh, procced first. Uh, this way. Yep, okay, cool. Because just in case, I, I have a feeling that doing the autopsy might overwrite the Gravedigger stuff and vice versa or something. So just in case, let's try to get the quests at least started. Hello, hello. I've advanced the main plot. Talk to me. A prisoner died recently. Is he in the cemetery already? Don't know. You can have another body. They all reek the same. I'm after a specific corpse. Particular. Come back when you know what you want. Examining remains is an art. Always worthwhile to look deeper. But who does that concern? You seem to know a lot about the deaths in the city. Ever help with investigations? Sometimes I inform Raymond about the more interesting dead men. Maybe you can tell me, too. No. I promise to keep quiet. I see. What do you need? Farewell. Okay, that ties uh, Vincent in, I think, or was it Raymond? Whatever. Talk to Shani, okay. Try talking to Vincent now that we have the uh, graveyard more. Uh, now that we have the graveyard opening up more. That's over on this side. God, that dog was zooming. And these are back. Nope, oh, just the one. Okay. And yeah, I could get more by going over. It's literally right here. By going over along here, but whatever. Who's this? Hey, Benson. I'd like to not need to pay off his debt. <laughs> Many bandits. Right. What is? Damn it. Okay, shiny at night. It is. What a day. 
Let's see if Talar has anything about him, though. I don't think I've gotten the information yet, so we shouldn't, but just in case. Yep. Okay. I'll find you. Hold on, does he have wares? Totally forgot that he was a fence. No. Reddit. Got books. Okay. I can sell these, though. Okay. Let's go back to Raymond's place, because let's see if we can find another couple of weapons. Uh, because of all the loading screens, I kind of suspect that they've deleted by now, but if they're there, that would be good. Finally found something I finally found someone I can actually sell friggin' weapons to. Nope, they're gone. Okay. Well, noted for the future. How much we got? 20. Ugh. Oh, wait for night. Talk to Shawnee. Same. Light the fire, you asshole. Oop. Why stay and rot here? Because it's cheaper. Hi, Shawnee's grandma, assumedly. Or, no, her landlady or whatever. Hello. Uh, she's not back yet. Oh, no, she is. Wow, you really blend in there. Yes. Shawnee, I wanted to ask you something. Mm hmm. I need your help with an autopsy. An autopsy? Since when do you deal with stuff like that? Since I started investigating Salamandra. Okay, though, I'm no coroner. You'll have to interpret our findings. We'll meet in the evening. Until then, gather as many clues as possible. I'll sniff around. Get the body from the grave digger. We'll meet at the hospital in the evening. How do I find information to help the autopsy? Ask Vincent Mice, but also look for books on anatomy and pathology. Farewell. Well, I try to read every book I can find, so I think I should be okay on that end. Talk to Vincent, though, is something new. Uh, okay, there we go. I think I might have accidentally took the long way there, but I, at least I managed to reorient myself by not looking at the map. Or without looking at the map. Vincent, you still here? Yes, you are. What if you ever do autopsies? What for? Punctured stomachs mean gang warfare. Torn off heads mean beasts. And black tongues mean poison. The first case, we pressure ram's meat. The second, we pass on to the order or a witcher. The third, we go to the victim's wife. The culprit 90% of the time. Autopsies are a waste of time. Okay. Gonna try that again. What? No? See ya. Okay. Let's talk to the grave digger then. I want to try to do this on the up and up if, if at all possible, but it might not be possible. I think Carol better have some good boots. Hello, you. What do you need? Uh... Could you hand over the prisoner's body for an autopsy? For a bottle of dwarven liquor. I'll think about it. What do you need? You seem... Sometimes I inform... I don't trust Raymond. 
He's hiding something. Raymond? You wouldn't find a more loyal man. He seems to be struggling with this case. I should help. Will you let me inside the cemetery? City authorities prohibited it. How can I change your mind? I'd need Captain Mice's permission. No other way to sway you? Actually, I have a terrible debt with Taller. Clear those debts, the cemetery key's yours. Farewell. And that's how you do it. You can either talk to Taller and clear his debts, or you can talk to Vincent and get a key, or pass, or whatever. Grave Digger's Gratitude. There it is. Okay, Vincent. Give me a fucking key. You know, I'm seeing enough of the, uh, sunset light that I'm kind of wondering how they do the lighting for this. Like, is it literally just they kind of choose a spot for the light to or to to originate from in the skybox and kind of move it in time with the in-game time passage and then change the color at uh, evening and morning or something? I don't know enough about game lighting to really be able to say much about that. What is it, Witcher? Can you get me a pass into the cemetery? No trouble. Maybe you can clean it up while you're there. Deal. I'll see. I wonder if he is more of a hard ass about that if you haven't done like, ah, here are the various trophies and stuff. Because the cockatrice is required, but getting him other trophies and like doing whatever side quests I totally forget he had at the moment, Doing those would be optional and would get him more on your side. I'd have to go... God, you're just glowing blue on your collar. I know it's just the metal reflecting the light, but it is vibrant. Anyway, uh... But I, I'd have to go back and check again what we've actually done with Vincent to know how much we've done in terms of side questing to help him out. And he's gone. Okay. Jay. Anatomy of a crime. Need to talk to the grave digger. That's for later. Grave digger's gratitude. Go to the grave digger now. Pass. Okay, yeah, there's that. Because that'll then complete and feed into this. It'll skip over the bribe into the next phase. That's for later. That's for later. Talk to Shani more often. I'm I'm gonna talk to her soon anyway, but I'm a little bit confused as to why this is still a thing. You're paused. You're paused. Your main quest. That's Levardin. I should probably look at how to how to how to uh keep going with that. But that might be a chapter three thing. What lies beneath? Search for, search for leads on my own. Okay. I think that going to the graveyard is just the main thing at this point. Hi there, Gravedigger. Any chance you're still on duty? Oh my god, you actually are. You need? I want to get inside the cemetery. City authorities prohibited it. I have a pass from Captain Mice. Here are the keys. Go inside where we lay the fresh ones. But if they kill you, don't return to haunt me. Farewell. Cool. So... I suppose I, I go in here first, then talk to Shawnee after, because I don't have the corpse yet, and Shawnee won't come with us. I, uh, Shawnee can fight, actually. We know that from the end, from the end of the uh, chapter one. Anyway, I'm going to save here just in case. Okay. Zima Cemetery, currently quite non-active. Okay, we got full map view. Crypt entrance. Trade quarter. We're from the temple quarter. So that's an entire area we haven't gone to yet. That's almost certainly going to be locked. Chapel ruins. Hey, ghouls. Nope, nope. Silver. And dead. We're already finding a lot of undead here. No? 
And quite figured out how to not do invisible walls. Got it. God, that works so well. And you. Eight orins and white roses. Oh, well, collects. I haven't seen them yet, but okay. Now, I don't want to go too fast here, because I do want my, my endurance to regen so I can fight more. It seems like a very bad idea to have stagnant water next to a cemetery. Especially in this world where the dead get back up occasionally. That's the crypt. Okay, we can go in the crypt. Let's not do that yet. But good to know that it is a thing. Okay, we got crow's eye over here or whatever. There's the lake. Okay, got another bit of water there. These... Oh, that's not all of our roots, because we had one that went, like, into this. Hellebore. Oh, God, I can go in this... Oh, oh, that cannot be clean. Oh, God. Geralt, please take a shower after this. Fast. Uh, they're a little bit stronger. Okay, loot. Drown dead. All oh, right, it's not a drowner to drown dead. There's a difference. I pretty much want to clear out this area of enemies unless these respawn. They have not yet, at the very least. Oh, yeah, great. Now I'm going into nighttime. Perfect timing. Okay, get one at least. Strong style, get the other one. Okay, or that. I saw something behind me. And coup de gras. Yay. Okay, so those three dead. I think that's all of them. Ooh, Marrow. Oh, well, there's an Al Ghul as well. Okay, that just didn't work for some reason, I guess. Anything useful over here? Aldine. At this point, I'm just waiting for a vampire, pretty much. <laughs> like, we have seen one or two in, in this area, well, in Vizima in general, so it's not like it's impossible. Rosai. Selendine. Oh, wow, those are not the roots I thought that plant would have. The other bit of water. That we can apparently walk through. Oh, hi there. Just, just die. And... Loot. Okay, and then this is the trade quarter. Locked. Good. And try this corner over here. Nope. Water. Try the fallen chapel. Which, do city cemeteries generally have chapels in them? Like, not just as, like, the graveyard is the backyard of the chapel or something, but straight up in the middle? That, that seems like just 
You know what? Actually, I can see how that'd be a thing. Like, it grows out naturally from the chapel as the center focal point. You essentially keep running out of space on either side. Relief. No idea what that's used for. Okay, well, we cleared out this area, at least. The problem is that uh, there's no fireplace. And if I go in here, it's going to be dark. So I'm actually going to back out, find the nearest fireplace, make a cat potion, probably wait till morning, then come back in. Morning won't make any difference to the crypt, but it'll make it so that there's less stuff that's going to spawn in here when I come back. Cool. I was waiting for the cutscene of some of something ambushing me. Oh, well, you're still here. Okay, Harry Bear is the one that I know to go to. And you're just always on duty. Nope, no vampire? Okay. Alchemy, cat, mix, wait till morning, go. Okay, back on the job. Oh, Witcher, Witcher. Oh, it crashed. Hold on, back in a moment. Okay, back in, and the latest all save was the crypt. So, uh, good thing I went into the crypt, I guess. And there weren't any particularly special enemies, so let's go ahead and just kind of skip doing all that. Like, I got a couple extra plants, fought a couple of ghouls or whatever. Eh, no particular need to do that. I can come back at night to do that at any point, I think. I really thought that this exit was going to do an autosave. Kind of disappointed that it didn't. I really should probably just keep one instance of cat on me at all times. Actually, if I can make two now, I might. It does take an inventory slot, admittedly. Okay. Do this again. Cat. Go. Morning. Go. I got terrified there for a moment. And since we did all the same thing again there, let's go ahead and do this right quick. Good, comparatively. What's up? Yay. I saw a barrel there. Yeah, I didn't see that this time either. Where is barrel? Oh, there it is. Shit, that's actually a good haul. Hell, that almost doubled my money. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure that's not... That, does, that doesn't mean anything. Oh, you can come out during the daytime. Good for you. Come on. There we go. So, owl ghouls can come out in daytime, ghouls can't. Maybe that's the logic. Nothing yet. 
All right, because we got to the crypt, so we got past this part. Unknown herb. Oh, okay. And Kudra. And put it away. Into the crypt. And immediately save, to be safe. Inventory. Cap. Go ahead. Hi. Bye. So this crypt does have some lighting. I suppose could they do actively use it? Huh. That's interesting reasoning if that is accurate. Uh, you know what, sure, we don't have a ton of food on us, so go ahead and get some stocked up so we can have some emergency heal. Actually, Flint, running a little bit low. Hi. Join your friend. Map. Oh, wow, okay. Um. Oh, it's on world. Okay. I was trying to figure out why the hell it defaulted to the entirety of Tamaria. Okay, so we have forward, left, and right. Let's do left first, I guess. Yeah, that was the ghoul, all right. Wait for a second charge to build up, then. Just gonna take a couple of seconds here to sip some tea. That should be good. Hi. Oh, come on. <laughs> there. You haven't seen me yet. Given that there's a Gravia, a Gravia, and two ghouls, I'm gonna go ahead and do this. Uh, e? Yeah. Okay, pull two of them. You, 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 go, go, go. Yes. Much preferable to kill this one than that one first. Where'd the other one go? Oh, it went back down. Okay. 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 Stamina is on its way back. And... Yep, yep. Go. I could have just fought it normally, but I just feel like taking these down with Ard. Oh. Fuck. Fast. Okay, thank you, game. Damn, oh, yes, got it. Okay. Fair enough, game. Fangs of a vampire. And you. And you. Should be one more, I think. And I think I know how many I killed. Okay, guess I go. I guess I don't get to loot the other one. Oh well. Oh no, there you are. Oh, Raymond's corpse. Diamond dust weapon upgrade. Can I just. I can. Is that permanent? 
Hold on, I, I don't remember this item at all, actually, so let me go ahead and look this up. Uh, from you. Which suspect are you? Suspect Ramsmeat. Augustine. Yeah, sure, from Mysterious Tower, why not? Actually, no, I need the uh, Sephiroths. Let's just open a new tab. Uh, increases damage inflicted by 40% for 24 hours. Okay, it's not permanent. Okay, good upgrade. Two Orans on the altar, huh? Are these tiles graves? Yeah, I guess they are. Huh. Okay. So, uh, Raymond's dead. Uh, you, you. Okay. Inventory. Right click. Come on. There we go. I want to get that little bit of regen going. Yeah, sure. Nothing super important, but nice to have. Sure is dead. Okay, so that continues this way, so what's in here? Any ghouls? No. Okay. That's the lower one, right? Yeah. With the diamond dust as an as a as an item that you just kind of get, and then these and then that there. Are we going towards kind of a boss fight here? That didn't work. Oh, it did. Like, the boss fight where we found Vin- or, Give away my, my point there. The fight where we found Vincent seems like more of the boss fight because it was uh, both a strong wave, then an even stronger enemy after that. Like, that's the definition of a boss fight. Yeah, I think we, think we got through everything. So I'll save the diamond dust for, like, our big end of chapter boss fight or something then, I guess. Six hours, six and a half hours remaining on a cat. But, that being said, I wish I knew what that was, because there's a couple of them. I'm kind of surprised there are herbs that I don't know what they are at this point in this area. Anyway, uh, because we are getting up there on the time, I'm going to go ahead and cut the episode here. So, if this video hasn't ruined your life, then go ahead and do that YouTube stuff here a million times. I hope you have a wonderful remaining of your day. I hope to see you in the next one where we will continue to figure out the mystery of Zima Confidential now that our detective is dead. Well, this has a cutscene here. Okay, it didn't. Actually, did we even get the right corpse now that I think about it? Whatever, we'll deal with that next time. <laughs> See you in the next one. Bye.